Hello everyone, Mauro here. In this lesson, we are going to look at the steps to enable and disable the Windows Recovery Environment or WinRE on Windows 11, but this also should work on Windows 10. WinRE is an essential component designed to help you to troubleshoot and repair issues that may prevent the operating system from booting correctly. When your computer encounters a problem, accessing the recovery environment allows you to use advanced recovery options such as startup repair, reset this PC and the UEFI settings and others. Windows 11 keeps this feature enabled by default and is recommended to keep it that way. However, if you need to disable it for a specific reason, the operating system provides a command tool to manage the ability of this tool. Okay, let's dive into the steps to enable or disable the recovery feature. But before, please subscribe to the channel and click the like button to help YouTube show this video to more people. It doesn't cost anything and you will be helping the channel and supporting my work. You can also visit my website for more tutorials and related tech news. Now, since there is a good chance that the Windows recovery environment is already turned on on your computer, let's look at the steps to disable the feature. And to do this, first look for command prompt or the terminal and run it as administrator. In my case, I'm going to switch to command prompt, and then I'm going to run this command to see the state of the feature. And as you can see, the recovery environment is currently enabled, and this is the actual path. Now, to disable the feature, we only need to run the same tool, but with the disable option, and then press enter. Now, here we can see that the operation has completed successfully. However, we can rerun the previous command in order to see the state of the feature. And as you can see, it's now set to disable and there is no allocation for it. Once you complete the steps, the system will disable the recovery environment and it will copy the winre.win file from the recovery partition to the recovery folder inside of the system32 folder part of the Windows installation. So if we go to the C drive, from here we go to Windows, system32, and then then there should be a recovery folder. And if you don't see the winery that win file, we need to show the system hidden files. So we want to check that option, click apply, okay. And we also need to show hidden files right here. And as you can see, the image has now been transferred to this folder. One more thing that I wanted to point out is that while the feature is disabled, you can continue using the operating system normally. However, you won't be able to access the advanced startup settings or the Windows recovery environment to troubleshoot or resolve issues with the operating system. Now, to enable the Windows recovery environment on Windows 11, it's pretty much the same process, but we're gonna have to use the enable option first open start and look for the terminal or command prompt and then run it as an administrator in my case i'm going to switch to command prompt then to confirm the state of the feature we're going to run this command and it is disabled and now we're going to run the enable command to turn on winery on windows 11 and press enter it might take a few seconds because now the system is actually copying the winre that win file to the recovery partition and making all the configuration changes so now if we rerun the info command we can see that the Windows Recovery Environment is enabled and this is the location. So now if we look again inside of the recovery folder, we're going to see that the winre, that win file is no longer here and that's because it has been transferred to the recovery partition. Now, even though we can access the recovery partition, let me show you that if we go to this management on the main drive, usually the installation of Windows has three partitions. One is the EFI partition, then the main partition where the operating system is, and then there is the recovery partition. And and that's where the winery, that win file is located. And that's from the location. But the system will start if we want to open the recovery environment to access troubleshooting tools to fix issues on Windows 11. And that's it. That's how you enable and disable the recovery environment on Windows 11. Let me know in the comments if you have to use the enable option or the disable option. Also like the video, share it, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet. And I just hope this video was informative for you. And I would like to thank you for viewing.